is it? At this level, a lot of them have had injuries before because they've been skating their whole lives and at this speed and this sport, it's more likely to happen than not at some point. Um, but the serious injuries are the ones that take a lot more time because we don't know if they're going to be able to come back. Every time I start with a team, and I don't care what level this is, I do say if it's my first time with a team, everybody has to meet with me one time. Everybody. After you meet with me that one time, you never have to talk to me again if you don't want to. But let's at least assess each other, see where you are, see if there's something I can do to help you. Typically, when I come out, I have at least two or three come and say, I need to meet with you this week. And so I'll pull my phone out and we make appointments. Otherwise, they, they'll call me, they'll text me, they'll e e email me. I probably have maybe six sessions a week on average. Sometimes eight, sometimes ten, sometimes two. Um, and obviously, if they're traveling and I'm here, I might talk with them on the phone, but that's usually if somebody's freaking out about something, they'll call me. But I, I so I generally don't hear from them when they're traveling. Or I might get an email or a text or something. Hey, I did awesome in this race, or you know, something like that. But generally, I'm not going to hear from them when they're traveling unless there's something going on. I think if we were talking to younger skaters, they want to be 